previously on Persona 5. Oh, I'm actually seeing, this is funny, I'm seeing little QR codes like popping up in the air. So I guess she's a hacker, a technical minded Somewhere. person. You know, I wonder if I somehow managed to scan those that actually show me something. See it. I wouldn't even put it past them. And now back to sticking it to the man. Rain, huh? Ah, just viewed her as cool. Grease cooler would do it. Calling cars ready. That was fast. I mean, I already wrote three of them before this, remember? But I came up with almost all of the sentences. <laughs> Don't gotta mention that. Smooth, Ryushi. The real question here is when we should go to Futaba's room. Well, um, I think our leader should decide. Look who's the smooth one now. It really should be up to him, though, don't you think? Absolutely. We have no choice but to carry this out. It's all on you, Nico. There you have it. Sounds like a pretty important task got pushed on you. No point in thinking about it now, though. We have to do it. Just make your mind. Just give the orders the usual hideout. All right. Oh, man, it sucks having to have, have to go to bed. Oh, wait. That's right. Feeling tired when you request massage. Oh, yeah. Hey, Kawakami, get what? over here. Let's get naked. Oh, you're seriously requesting a massage? Fine. Have you know I trained while working in, Vic in Victoria? My skills are amazing. Okay, I'll head right over. Just, just wait for me. Oh, oh, snap, baby. Oh, oh. How is this woman so strong? Feels like my body's being kneaded with iron rods. Oh, God. Oh, damn. She looks like she's really going hard on my ass right now. Oh. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> like Morgana's like, like, I'm not looking. I'm not looking. Look, Morgana, look. I got some sexy girl. Oh, just need my butt cheeks. Like, oh, yeah. Frick flapjacks, baby. Oh, thank you, Jesus. All right, lower. Lower. Lower, Kama Kame. Come on, lower. All right, you got the spot. Now, deeper. Master. So, what do you think of the amount of force I'm using, Master? It's perfect. Take it down a notch. I don't feel anything. It's perfect. Right? I'm a professional at this after all. Jeez. Oh, your body's pretty fit. What the heck do you do? do what the heck do you do to get like this? Oh, uh, you know. Fucking murder monsters. Well? <laughs> I wonder what would happen if you're actually like dating her. We should be like, like, all right. <laughs> actually, she probably would give you a happy ending. She's like, all right, flip over. So, do you feel a bit lighter now? I feel, it really does feel lighter. Any fatigue I felt earlier is all gone. Most of like I spent the day dicking around. It's like that was pretty effective. As you're refreshed now, you could probably do some something else before the night ends. See you later. Run right, heading home. Don't overwork yourself, okay? No happy ending? Ah, oh, damn. Actually, I'd be curious if it really would change anything, you know, if you were dating her, if she would actually, like, do something. Hey, probably. I don't know if she'd really, like, <laughs> she'd really go that far, but if she did, oh, uh, then I would start regretting <laughs> my, <laughs> my decisions. I can call Kamikami to come over again. Is there any point to that, I wonder? Actually, I wonder if I can call her again to to make this. Yes, the eternal lockpick. One lockpick to rule them all. Want to try seeing Kawakami? Get over here, girl, don't worry. Hi. Hi, Scott. Oh, for fuck's sake, I was just over there. Well, then I'll be here just did last time. Oh my god. Yes, I can't wait. It's kind of interesting. So for this one, it seems like we didn't uh, get a party member or anything. Seems like we're starting to sort of spread out to the acquisition of uh, new party members. I had you guys tell me that this Afumi one is actually pretty uh, pretty useful. So maybe I'll get started on hers then, since the fortune teller isn't around. I haven't, I haven't even talked to you. I have no idea what you look like. Shogi playing student. Hey, hey, girl's playing Shogi. Maybe she's Safumi Togo, the one Yusuke mentioned. Why don't you go ask her? Togo-san? Hafumi-chan? <laughs> What? Uh, uh, um, but yes? Oh, you're kind of cute. Got a little, got a little ribbon thing in your hair. My overflowing charms, he's ever reached a fume. I'm so gorgeous. Ah, I can't look at you directly, you're just too beautiful. I'm a Fumi Togo. Playing Shogi at church? Playing Shogi by yourself? I'm doing some research, so. <sighs> Experimenting with new tactics is best to do alone in a place like this. Well, I suppose that doesn't sound terribly plausible to someone who doesn't play. Don't mind me. Please, go ahead and pray. Uh, Fumi Togo seems to take a very tactical approach to playing Shogi. If I can learn some tactics for the Phantom Thieves from her Shogi expertise, I should ask her if she'll teach me. Teach me, Senpai! 
Yes? Can I help you? <laughs> I like your little outfit. It's got like, they look like little emblems. Actually, that's, I think those are Shogi pieces on your outfit, aren't they? Can you teach me Shogi? Can I be your student? Can you teach me Shogi? Huh? Um, you don't necessarily have to learn from me, you know. There are other options, such as playing online. Sorry, I just can't. Well then. I recognize the voice actress too. Um. <laughs> so, you like Shogi? Yeah. I admire you. Huh? <laughs> You're a little awkward, aren't you? Oh, um. Thank you very much. Yeah. Um. Okay, just a quick game then. 20 seconds per move, if that's all right with you. I don't know how to play. Well, me. I'll start. So this is your skill level, huh? The dragon which governs the blue sky has fallen into my hands. How do you intend to survive this? Wait, what are you talking about? Oh, wait, I thought we were playing check it. Oh, I knew it. I, I looked it up because I was like, this is going to drive me fucking insane. I know I recognize this voice. She did Diana from Zero Time Dilemma. Oh, and they also, and also, uh, even more recently, Devil and Pupla <laughs> from Nier Tomina and Nier. I was like, oh my God. Wow. Actually, I didn't, I didn't realize that was the same voice actress as Diana, too. Oh, my God. I was I was like, I feel like a fucking idiot. And I feel like, is it, is it someone in near? But I was trying to, I was like, who is it? It's not Kaine. That's Laura Bailey. That's definitely not her. Oh, my, oh my God. Wow. I hear it everywhere. You're in all my Let's Plays. You daddy God. I don't know if Laura Bailey's in this game, too. But do that or have the full party. Uh, or, or Meal's voice actor. Or actress. Actually, probably a girl. Oh, fuck. It's checkmate, no matter how you look at it. Please concede. I can still keep going. To concede is an act of admitting that you have lost with grace. I'd rather die in a blaze of glory. If you aspire to become a shogi player, I recommend that you take your study of the game to heart. Ah. Thank you for playing. You're my bitch now. Well then, that will be all for today. If it's all right with you, May I request another match sometime? I feel a gambler's spirit emanating from you. Also, I get a real kick out of punning noobs. Which is strange, since your style of play is that of a complete novice. Sorry, I, I'm a beginner. <laughs> huh? Oh, I'm sorry. However, I will instruct you under one condition. Okay. You become my playing partner so that I can research new moves. Is that agreeable? Sounds good to me. <laughs> I'm, I'm scared. Thank you very much. <laughs> I should have picked that one, damn it. I'm well scared. Then, it's a deal. I'll teach you how to play, and you'll assist me with my new moves. I made a deal with the Fumi. I swear, I can, they come up with the funniest fucking responses in this game. Back to the future. All right, I think I can see where this one's going. Tactical shit, blah, blah, blah. You had, totally had to have someone who knew about games. I think that quite advanced strategies are necessary to succeed at that many criminal acts. Yeah, called it. And yours weren't by the wit of an amateur. You had a professional who regularly deals with such tactics. You have an idea on who that is, don't you? Of course I know who it is. I am thou. Thou art But do you know who it is? Thou hast acquired a new vow. Am I telling her all about my confidants too? It's like ratting them out. That thy chains of I'm actually kind of shocked that I told her that Makoto, Makoto was one of the Phantom of the Thieves. Star persona, oh, you're the star persona. Okay. I actually kind of thought you'd be the tower. Power. Like tower, because, well, actually. I was thinking tower like a rook, you know, and chess. <laughs> But I don't think that's probably how that works. Star. Ko Komo Sabaki allows you to swap current party with backup members during Joker's turn. Oh, what? Seriously? Oh, that's... 
Oh, holy shit, that's awesome. That's really convenient. Oh my god, that's amazing. Thank you. All right. That's, wow, that's gonna really open up battles. I had a lot more strategy to be able to switch out dudes that I need. Okay, let's end here for today. I shall see you again if the fates allow. If the fates. I feel like playing with Fumi has helped my shop my fuck me and shop my knowledge. Oh, just one, okay. Alright. I'll have to remember that for next time then. Oh yeah. Hi. Hey girl, you know what I want. Alright, take my clothes up. No, no, that well, yes, but also that other thing you've been working on. Oh, one lockpick. That's all I need now. All right, I'll see you later. Thanks, Kakami. You seem really happy about this one. Oh, you have no idea. Oh, it's Ryuji, right? Yeah. Okay, Fumi Cho or to Togo. Nah, she's kind of she was kind of cute. Yusuke's classmate who strives to be a pro shogi player teaches you battle strategy for shogi. Uchi Komi. Chance for a follow-up by a backup member if Joker downs an enemy. Oh, nice. Oh, wow, yeah, you got some useful stuff. That one's really cool, actually. I, I, I think it will really come in handy. Okay, I'm not actually gonna do this, but I do wanna, I do wanna at least see what happens when I hang out with Ryuji yep. here. Hey, you know that Kong was talking about the other day? Hey, it's pretty awesome. Let's do it, man. Yeah, yeah come on, set up to your room. Morgana laying the fuck out. <laughs> oh man, this manga's the best. Fight between the main guy and his rival really gets me going. I want them both to win. I know, My Hero Academy is the best shit ever. So, hey, who do you usually root for? The main hero or the rival? They ain't hero, of course. Rival, actually. Hero's allies. Rival, man. Whoa. Oh, really? Me too! Rival characters are cool, but things don't always work out for them. I really get that. I knew, I knew that was who he's gonna pull for. God, can I keep reading? It's cool if I read the whole thing here, right? We're over through UG and we talked about battles and friendship. <laughs> battles, friendship. I feel like I learned more about determination to face things head on without ever giving up. Oh yeah, give it to me. All right. Gotta get enough guts, guts to impress the Y sensei. Oh, she's getting late. Sorry around so long. Damn, I'm, really, I'm getting really thirsty. Think you made me a cup of coffee with with tons of sugar, please. All right. Sure, man. For real? For real? Thanks, dude. Make sure it's extra freaking good. Whoa. I think you like coffee, dude. Hey, looks like you're in the hang of it. Are you confident in your abilities now? Rishi's gaze is intense. He seems to have high expectations. Some love in it. Do I right, do exactly? I was I was oh, I was taught. What an idea! Wow, man, you look like a real pro when you're pouring it. Whoa, this is great! Whoa, this is awesome! Who knew I'd like coffee? Man, I was here. I was thinking I hated it this whole time. All right, there we go. If there'd be a day I'd want to drink coffee. That's really full of surprises, huh? Yeah, man drink coffee and enjoy a leisurely conversation and talk more about friendship. <laughs> you want to go make out later? See ya. Wow, it's freaking late. Well, see you tomorrow, dude. That was fun. Oh my god, seriously? What now? <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mishima. I don't care, Mishima. Shut up! I got some intel and some weird weirdos been showing up at the planetarium. He's finally on summer vacation. You should come and help me investigate. We have to punish the deviant and save the children on a summer vacation. Let's go together tomorrow. What do you want to do? You want to go to the planetarium? No, fuck you all. I'm going to reload it anyway, so shut up, Mishima. <laughs> Never hang out with you again, ever, Mishima. You woke me up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Nico-san. It's actually a perfect day to do that because there's literally nobody available today. So, all right, Morgana, Morgana let's do this. Oh. Let's get to the photographer's room. We'll show her the calling card and immediately start the heist. There's plenty of time to prepare between, so make sure you're ready before then. Let's go. Yo. So when are we gonna charge a Futaba's room? There's no point thinking it over now. 
I got the calling card, so let me know when you decide. Now then. Stiff bird pa pass cases. We'll be handling the calling card directly to Futaba herself. Once we give it to her, we'll head straight to her palace. There won't be any time for prep work in between, so make sure you're ready beforehand. Okay. Okay. Are sure you're ready to go? Once Futaba sees the calling card, we'll need to head straight to her palace. Is that okay? I know this. It's our fourth time doing it for Morgana. I think I figured it out by now. Oh. So you're sitting on doing this? Looks like it's my turn to unlock the entrance. Forgive me, Chief. With that aside. How will we convince Futaba to let us into her room, though? Even boss is forbidden entry. Uh. Be honest? Yes, that is the best course of action. Oh? You know a method. I think it's quite straightforward. Futaba doesn't know what we're doing inside her palace, correct? Hence, if we tell her we've come to steal her heart, she'll surely open the door and let us inside. Hmm? <laughs> Wait, that's it? Futaba wants to have a change of heart. After all, she contacted us for that express purpose. That desire should let her lead her to open the door as well. That's a smart idea. You're right. Our flings should get through to her through if we just try and talk to her. Yeah. All right. Believe I believe in Futaba. Come on, let's get this done. Mm. <laughs> She's sitting in her chair like Elle does. An eyeball? What's this? When did it get on here? Oh. Oh. What? Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Why did you get the app? Who are you? I am the other you. Is this some kind of hallucination? It's different from usual. It's way more vivid. So she got the app now? How the fuck did that happen? How long will you continue blaming yourself and shutting yourself away from the world? <laughs> Don't say it. You're not me. <laughs> Please. Based on my Persona 4 experience, that tends not to work. Blaming myself for what? For your mother's death. Don't you think it's time you grasp the truth of that moment? What happened before your eyes? What happened to your mother? The, the truth? Why did you choose to rely on the Phantom Thieves? That's... Are you simply going to shut yourself in and do nothing? Are you going to avert your eyes from the true answer? <laughs> if so, I will kill them in your world. Oh. I... What should I do? We're sorry for sneaking in so many times, boss. There's no mistaking it. This is the same door as in the palace. Hello, Futaba. You're there, aren't you? Please, answer us. I doubt she'd answer. Alibaba, we know you're there. It doesn't matter if it's through chat messaging, just answer us. Nick. Nee. You should have told me you were going to come. In order to steal your heart, we need you to open this door. We can't change your heart otherwise. Please let us in. I'm not mentally- <laughs> I'm not mentally prepared. <laughs> you have to do this. It's easy for you to say. The other you within your heart told us to have you open it. Deep down, you want to open this door, don't you? The other me. Right. We're trying to uphold our promise, but you're the one resisting us. Give me some time. Ten seconds. <laughs> That's too short. At least minutes, please. Fine, but if boss comes home, we'll kick down the door and enter if we must. Time's up, Alibaba. All right, I'll open it. We need to change her cognition. Better to be completely safe than sorry. So she has to be the one to invite us in. Futaba, please open the door. Uh, hey! All right, let's go in. Ah! <laughs> what is this? <laughs> ah, it stinks in here! Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh my god, that is some smelly Chinese food. Medical science, 
Information technology, biology, psychology. We, these are all technical books. Oh, hey, she got Featherman, too. She keeps herself cooped up in a room like this all the time? It's a little small. It actually really does remind me of my room from Persona 4. Where's Futaba? I know, where is she? Is she in the closet? Could she be hiding? <laughs> the closet? Yeah! <laughs> Futaba, come out of the closet! I like to, but I can't! Tom Cruise is in here too! Yeah, I'm in here too. We're staying here forever. She'll shut herself in to the bitter end. Hmm. Nah. Even if that door's opened up, we'll get stopped again inside. I bet a fence or something formed right in front of the treasure now. This, this, this makes no sense. Explain yourself. Nah. Wow, she talked. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> we needed to change your cognition. Unless we do so, we can't steal your heart. We got you. We got to see you and your all oh, your little adorableness. I highly doubt she would understand it, even if we explained it to her. So basically, my cognition is being a hindrance, keeping you away from the core of my cognitive world. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my God! Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Huh? She understood it. Well, why do you know about that? Who are you? <sighs> Why'd you call yourself Alibaba and make things more complicated? If you wanted help, you could have just asked for it. Yeah. Because I was embarrassed. Meh. Huh? Oh, m my bad. I didn't catch that. Because <sighs> I was embarrassed. I think I get it. Asking someone for help isn't that easy. Futaba, can you tell us more? How do you know about the cognitive world? Because I knew about it. Oh, that reminds me. Boss was talking about cognition or something before, right? You think this is related to how he was getting grilled by that one lady? Perhaps her mother was researching this cognitive science that was mentioned? Oh. Cognitive science with a PSI in front? Less science, more supernatural? That's important. <laughs> okay. You tell me there's a different pronunciation to that, because I swear they sound exactly the same to me. Well, that certainly got her attention. It seems we're on the right track. So, cognitive science. Futaba, what was your mother working on? Futaba, open the door. I'm going to have Morgana poop on your chair. Please tell us. What happened? She's not answering. Shouldn't we do this later? She seems to have gone through some shit in the past. True. She did say things like, die. Hold on. Futaba-chan, did you really kill your mother? Whoa, you moron! Wasn't her death an accident? What actually happened? Maternity neurosis? Is that really true? On. We saw what your heart is like, but we still can't figure anything out. The mother that Boss told us about is completely different from your cognition. Yeah. We want to hear the truth from your mouth. My mom was... The one who killed her was... It's possible that she can't remember because her heart has become distorted. I'm so sorry, Futaba-chan. I, um, a lot happened, so I'm sorry. There! Now steal it! <laughs> <laughs> What's gotten into you all of a sudden? Yeah, you got some short shorts on. We did come to steal your heart, but it, it's not really done right here at this moment. Yeah, but you did good. We're, we're, we're partway there. All you really had to do was open that closet door. <laughs> I'm sorry we made you jump to conclusions. You don't have to be like that. All right, get her, guys. Ah! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I see. <laughs> she went back in. What's the meaning of this? Did, did you guys trick me? No, please listen. 
There's a reason we had to do this. She's aware of the cognitive world, but it seems she doesn't understand how a change of heart occurs. Um, Futaba, how much do you know about the cognitive world? I know that there's another world based on cognition, but I don't know how to get there. Can you guys go there? You said you saw my heart earlier. Yes, that's right. How do you do it? We use a smartphone app. An app? Yeah. Yes. By entering the required information, we can go to the cognitive world. Yeah, it's free download on the, on the Apple Store. A name, a place, and a distortion. Those three. So in this case, Futaba Sakura, Sojiro Sakura's house, and... Futaba? You don't happen to have this app, do you? Uh, I don't. Thank goodness. No. Okay, then. Oh, God. Can you take me with you, too? Uh, no. <laughs> uh, I gotta agree. Just leave this to us. I'll leave it to you, then. Oh, fuck. Good. And you better not forget about our promise, all right? Oh, she's gonna jump in there with us. Little dorky psycho. Oh, yeah, almost forgot. The treasure's not gonna appear if we don't have her read this. There you go. Look at that. A calling card? It's the one you prepared. Read it. I can't read it. It's too dark. <laughs> you could just come out. It's embarrassing. <laughs> oh my god. You're incredibly what? introverted. I'll make sure she reads it, so you guys go on ahead. Alright, Mr. Kitty, I'll leave this to you. You're a file around the cat, right? Make sure you read it, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Futaba Sakura has committed a great sin of drowning in sloth. Ah, there you go. Okay, so you're sloth, I see. Thus, we will rob every last bit of those distorted desires. <sighs> oh. No. I'm going to die. Oh, here it goes. 99. Is your shirt say? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Kitty, you again? <laughs> bad Kitty, that's a bat! <laughs> Alright, be a good girl, Futaba, and stay here. Don't do it. Don't jump in with us. Oh, here we go. My jam's coming on now. <laughs> How scared a little so I can feel from all the way out here. Taba seemed totally up for getting her heart stolen. What's up with this? Ooh, something's up. Something's about this place is really unusual. Anyway, there's only one thing for us to do now. We set the calling card. Hell yeah! No matter what we gotta face, we're gonna take we're gonna take that treasure for sure. Ba -ba -da -da. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 Alright guys, let's fucking do it. I'm ready. A fucking demon do. All right, there's only one chest that I need to get. So. Oh. The eternal lock. Oh, her eyes. At, more guys' eyes start glowing. Like, oh, you have the eternal lock. We can do this as much as we want now. Retention. Oh, for fuck's sake, seriously. All a bunch of shit that I could just buy it. Freaking wise. Come on. Oh dear. Oh, it's the monkey. Oh, he flicked it on himself. Oh, yeah, I can actually capture you now. I'm strong enough level. Oh, nice. Oh, mid battle ch party change. Fumi Togo's confidant ability, Komo Sabaki, allows you to switch out party members mid battle. On Nico's turn, you can select who to switch in by pressing L2 and selecting party from the order menu. Switching out party members will count as Nico's action for that particular turn. Also, you cannot switch out an afflicted teammate. Oh, okay. That's so cool. That's awesome. All right, monkey. Ah, uh, me no listen. But that eyes me at my turn. Listen to what you have to say. Good, good. Thank you. Shit, I didn't actually look to see what he was though. I talked too loud. Fine. 
Okay, all right, all right. Yeah, you're serious. I figured just based on Angry Monkey. What if you go to a place where you could die at any, any moment? Um, I want kids. I'm not comfortable with this. Uh, I want kids. Damn it! Oh, oh, he gave me a Megiddo skill card. That's pretty good. There. Yeah. Yes, got your monkey. Thaw. I got a reading monkey on my team. Yay! My little monkey friend. Okay, because I know I am absolutely over leveled by this point. I'm going to be churning up that difficulty again. And I'm not going to just wussy out like I did fucking before, all right? I've committed. I'm going to do this shit. All right, let's do this. Hey, she read the calling card. I mean, after all the trouble we went through, she damn well better have read it. Whoa. All right. Yeah. All right, it's open. Yeah, well, yeah, futaba -chan opened the door herself. Nice. Anyway, the treasure's up ahead. Let's finish this. What will the treasure be, then? Her memory of her mother? Her actual mother? I think that's probably what it is. Maybe she'll be the, the, the boss that we fight. Incredible. So... This is the place that rips is Futaba's room. Yep, it's the heart of a hacker, all right. Anyway, where's the treasure? This way. We get a strong signal from above us. The tre treasure definitely is manifested. There's no knowing what may lie ahead, so be vigilant as we push towards the treasure. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh God, we still got more stuff. Ooh, it's getting kind of complicated. Getting a little MC Escher up in the air. Oh God. Oh, by the way, for those of you who said that I uh, I'll reveal your I couldn't uh, use Ryuji's move in the palaces, as you can see, you are not right. <laughs> Focus. Uh, ooh. Somewhere. I got a lot of these things over here. I have something. I can feel it. Up oh, one of these things has a treasure demon in it because I, I didn't manage to snag this one, the one from here. Oh, there's a chest in here too. Treasure chest spotted. Must be something good. And a super I'll powerful guy. I'm gonna bet there's two Anubises in here or something. Oh nope, Anubis and two monkeys. We got Balm of Life. All right. Oh now we got two Anubises. Oh I forgot. I'm on hard, so it's making it's harder to kill these enemies. Wasn't even occurring to me. I leveled up. Level up! Alright. Wasn't expecting to run into more enemies. Alright, we good. At least not any more pop out. What's the treasure demon? Which it isn't. Joke's no doubt the treasure's right past this point. There's maybe a way to us within. No matter what it is, we need to be ready for it. Alright, let's do this, baby. Yes. Coming to save you, Futaba chan. If I use this, I can change my heart? Vocal input. No, just let us do our thing, you goober. Fu. Fu. Futaba Sakura? Sojiro Sakura's house. And then something about distortion. 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 Hmm? Not again. You killed her! You're a plague! Murderer! It's all your fault! You're the one who killed her! Don't come near me! Your fault! Murderer! No! <sighs> That's right. I remember now. Back when they were here, I... I messaged Doom in the chat and... Oh, God. Input accepted. Searching for route to destination. I can go in now? No! You're a player! You're the one who killed her! It's your fault! Don't come near me! It's your fault! I can't take this anymore! Beginning navigation. Oh god, no, you goober, no! I'm gonna doom us all! Hell, this ain't what I was imagining. Were you expecting a mountain of treasure or something of that sort? There is that over there. Coffin. That's it? 
The treasure must be inside. Dead mom, maybe? All right, let's take it. Be careful. T treasure! Calm your tits, Morgana. There's something here. Oh, God. I got a bad feeling about this. What the demon lord is that? <laughs> the light. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Is it a shadow? No. Then it's not Futaba. <laughs> Mommy's home. Holy shit. Oh, she's got wings. Oh! Ah! That's freaky as fuck looking. If it's not a shadow, then what is it? It's a cognition! A monster that Futaba's cognition created! How could that be? Hey, look out! I don't think so, girl. I got you. Here it comes! <laughs> My guy's like, yeah. Oh, fuck me. That is truly bizarre looking. Do not approach the Pharaoh's tomb. It's a fucking Gryffindor. Misfortune will fall upon you. Shut up. You don't know me. Oh, look at it fly about. We can't reach it like this. We've got no other option. Let's take it down with our guns and skills. Okay. Do, do, do. Beast that rules the palace. Persona. Hold on, before we do that, let's uh. That's not right. Persona. Got a whole bunch of dudes with uh, defense and offensive stuff. So, all right, you. Black assist. All right. Finally, a defense for everybody. Here we go. Yes. Da -da -da -da. You see, eat a salt dive. Ah, oh, fuck. I am thou. Take this. The fuck? Come on. Feel my rage. Oh, there we go. Oh, ow. Kitty paw slam. All right, evasion. Eat this. Lightning. This is my other self. Stop moving. Can I just not hit with physical attacks? I, I okay, physical skills either. I, I guess I just gotta okay. I guess just the spells then. Spells and guns. Yes, you are good for something, skull. Nice one, Ryuji. Whoa! Oh fuck, dizzy. Let's go. Come on. There we are. Not doing anything to her? God damn. So your HP bar moving at all. Rapid ascent. Oh, fuck. How far did it fly up? What's it gonna do? Don't tell me. Is it gonna dive attack us? Oh fuck, defense reverted. Oh god, uh this is it. defense had to revert. This turn. Alright. Please don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. When's it gonna strike? Oh, it's still not coming. It's like I can do anything, but Oh. Hey, nice one. It's still not attacking. Are you serious? Well fuck you very much. Finally! Oh! All good! Everyone this is top of my thing, still be here. Alright, extend it. Oh, this isn't good. I can't tell at all when it's gonna attack. What do you mean you can't tell? You gotta tell us, Mona! I can't help it! 
There are some things that even I can't do. Stupid bird mom. Fuck. Oh, come on. What the hell? Oh, Jesus. So this is inside my heart. What are you doing, you gooberhead? You didn't even bring shoes with you. I didn't think it'd be like this. Uh. Huh? Do you remember? Oh god. We're, we're, looks like we're kind of going Persona 4 now with the shadow and the original self meeting. This is the suicide note. The men in black suits read it right after mom died. That's correct. Look at the next one. This. This is. When mom jumped in front of that car. That's right. Now the next. Oh. No. Don't run. I thought you made your mind up after you talked to the phantom thieves. Okay. Oh, look. It's me complaining. Mom scolded me for bothering her. Yes. I knew it. It was me who killed Mom. I was a bad daughter. I weighed her down and she hated me for it. It's just like I remember. Are you sure? Huh? Remember everything. Don't avert your eyes. Big old goofy glassers. When did this happen? Just a little before Mom died. I whined about wanting to go on a family trip. But she scolded me and said no. Was that all she said? Mom said, I'm too busy right now. I need to finish my cognitive research as soon as possible. And what did you do? I threw a tantrum. Told her she thought her research was more important than I was. That's when she scolded me. What did she say afterwards? There was more. Uh, did she say my research is almost over once it's finished we can go wherever you like I'm sorry I've left you alone for so long Futaba please try to understand though this research is really important I need to complete it even if it costs me my life what did she hate you she didn't? But what? She smiled. Ah, my head, it hurts. Which is true. You're your memories. Huh? Nope, stay away from the roof. There's nothing but bad things up here. It's calling me? Ah! The, the hell? We ain't doing shit to it. Yeah, we really aren't doing anything to it. Ah! Fuck, my insides hurt. Stupid bird. Fuck you. Huh? Futaba? Ah, oh, come on. I don't have time for this, Futaba. This is a bad fucking time. You came into your cognitive world? Mm hmm. The person themselves coming into their own palace? If that happens. Yeah, I feel like that's got to have a bad side effect. That's... You killed her! No! Why don't you say something? It's your fault! It's my fault. It's my fault that Mom... Ah! Wait, is that monster her mother? Yes, God! Futaba's desires and guilt must have distorted her cognition of her. The wish that her mother was alive again is mixed in as well, along with those eerie jeers. You are nothing but a demon who stood in my way. I wish you had never been born. That way I could have announced my results without having to waste my time on you. 
Jesus. What does she mean by that? Could she be talking about cognitive science? You're going to die. Nobody cares about me. Oh. I should never have had Futaba. She was always such a bother. No! Shut up, stupid hallucinations! It seems you caused your mother a great deal of trouble, Futaba Chan. She must have had some kind of maternity neurosis. Deep shit if this keeps up. So, because she thinks she killed her mother, and because she thinks she deserves to die, Futaba gave birth to a palace where her mother wants her dead? Futaba chan, look! There's no way that monster is your mother! Yeah, I think she really loved you. It's just an illusion you created! B but she never abused you, did she? Boss told us. He said she did her best to raise you alone. Isn't this a false memory that's been imprinted upon you? A false memory? Ugh. You made your mother destroy all her research, Futaba Chan. She had worked so hard on this well. She lost her mind, and it's all because of you. Who is this guy? Is this supposed to be your dad? It's your fault. Mom, I. It's her shadow. Futaba Sakura, remember. You're the reason she committed suicide. You were just getting in the way of her research. Why did you think it was suicide? Because of the note. Exactly. The men in black suits read her suicide note to you. And what was written on it? All of her complaints about me. Oh, I see. They they lied. They Oh, they they were it was a cover up. Wow, those pieces of shit. Fuck you, seriously? So they covered it up and they they pretended they made it look like it was all of her fault. So they put this girl through all this shit just because to hide probably what classified research. Yes. The shock and the pain led you to avert your eyes. But they kept reading it aloud in front of your relatives. Think hard. Was that suicide note real? Would the mother you loved so much truly have written that? Did she ever say such horrible things to you? No! <laughs> JLMK. She scolded me whenever I had tantrums, but she cared for me. Then what about the suicide note? A total lie! You were used. They forged her suicide note and laid the blame of her death upon you. They trampled all over your young heart. Get mad. Don't forgive those rotten adults. They deserve to fucking die. It's because I couldn't face myself for mom's death. Oh snap, we're getting you next then? Even then, why did they have to yell at me like that? Futaba-chan? Uh. What denies you is an illusion. Oh, here we go, yes! A curse put upon you by the heartless. You knew from the very beginning. And yet, you cowered in fear. Oh, that's right. I knew, but I... It's all your fault. This time you'll be the one to die. Will you die as you were told? Fuck you, no. Who will you obey? First words spat out by a seething illusion? Or the truth within your own soul? I've noticed that all of the... 
uh, I believe all the Persona's voices are our own voice, the voices of, of each of the characters. So, like, that's her voice right there, her voice actress. And, you know, Matthew Mercer's was his voice actor, voice actor and which makes sense because, you know, thou art thy and I am thou. But I, I like it and they because they put on a little bit of a different voice. So it almost it does sound a bit different, but I'm pretty sure it's it's the same actor. I won't let those distorted lies deceive me anymore. And I won't be led astray by others' voices either. Oh, hell yeah. I'm going to trust my own eyes and my own heart to distinguish the truth from the lies. There's no way you're my mom. You're just a fake created by those horrid adults. I'll... I'll never... I'll never forgive them! Oh shit, here we go, guys. Oh, whoa, whoa! Oh, whoa, what the? Ah, what the fuck? Oh, that's kind of kinky. <laughs> oh, shit, what in the hell is she doing? I am thou. Thou art I. The forbidden wisdom has been revealed. Oh. No mystery. No illusion shall deceive you any longer. <laughs> I'm okay. Look at that. Please help me. That's gotta go. Huh. Oh hell yes. Oh, you're gonna be our Risei Fuka, aren't you? Yes. Oh, sweet demon power. This is my heart's world, right? Hacking into my distortion should be no problem for me. <laughs> Look at her go. Whoa! She let you fell! Ballista? Holy shit! Shoot it down with this, then beat the crap out of it. Oh yes. Ah, I get it now. Let's go. Da da da. Fire that giant arrow thing, right? Hell yeah. Should I, <laughs> should I send a, uh, someone to shoot the Sphinx with the ballista? Fuck yeah. Mind if I do it? I'll shoot it. You want me to fire it, right? I'll shoot uh, it. Uh, let's go with. Uh, I need. I'm gonna need her to heal. So yeah, I uh, believe it's you, Ryuji. All right, let's go. Defense. I am down. I'll open you up. Eat lead, bitch. Ah! Fucking just use up all my ammo. Who gives a shit, right? Oh god. Ow. Slam. Oh god. Sphinx swipe. Oh, I love this song. Change direction. Aim the timid heart. Yes. Oh, my balls are tingling right now. Come on, Ryuji, you got this. It's time. Just gotta believe. It's not doing any damage to her, it seems like. Wing blast. Oh, God. Oh, don't think so. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Yes! Oh. Alright! Eat this! Oh! Oh! Shish kebab! Oh, this is it. Oh, this, is, this one really went differently, didn't it? This is really... This is what wild. So we didn't end up finding her shadow at all. And she and she ended up unlocking her persona powers. And now we got, got another new party member. I was thinking we were gonna get anyone this in this files or something. Shut up! You're not my mom! You're just a monster born from my own weakness! Everyone, keep attacking it! Don't let up! Yeah, <laughs> I like her little outfit. <laughs> I wonder if she gets a mask or anything. Ah, there we go. Okay, time to time to kick things up a notch. Power. 
Get wrecked. Ugh. Oh, damage. Yeah. Tempest Slash. Oh, 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 yes. Wow, you got a lot of health. Ugh. Only 92. Jesus. Okay. Groaning. What should I hit you with? Miracle Punch. Yeah. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Boom, boom, boom. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. You know, let's make sure we don't get ourselves killed. Because I am playing this on hard. Still growing in a race. Use case critical hits. Boom. I am down. Yeah, Miss Slurrush. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, back she goes. Oh, got a new one. That's not good. Oh, we're good? Ah! We're gonna fire that giant arrow thing, right? Me again? I'll shoot. Me again? Oh, my hands are still numb from shooting at her. I'll shoot. <laughs> you want Will it be slower, slower or something? I'll shoot it. All right, I'll have you All do right. it, you skip. Shotgun from a distance. <laughs> Dan has a serious long range shotgun. Use gate. I feel like I got a distractor, right? I'm assuming at least. I don't know. I might be wrong about that. But... Ah, crap, we're dizzy. Oh, despair. Shit. Gonna need to uh, get rid of that. Uh, repentance ashes. Yeah. There we are. Because uh, that didn't get to get to do a all out attack. Oh well. Boom! 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 Oh, he has that power. Almost there. Come on, baby. All right, decrease your defense while we're at it, and let's finish this. Time to die, bitch. This is my other self. All dirty demon lies. No matter what you say to me, I will live! Fire! Oh! Oh, yes! That was awesome! One single gunshot. Oh, dead! Oh, man, we're gonna eat like kings tonight, guys. Oh, yes! Did it, guys! On hard mode, I did it! Oh, I just saw Fatama was there too. She leveled up. All right, let's get rid of the old counter and replace it with the new one. My Buffalo's next. All right, so she's our Vise uh, Fuka, I guess. Futaba. Oh, look, she got little goggles on. Damn, you're freaking incredible. <laughs> oh, is it? oh, that must be your mask then. <laughs> it's so cool, like little night vision goggles. <laughs> Whoa, what in the world? 
Oh, I like your outfit. It looks cool. <laughs> Ooh, it's totally skin tight. <laughs> oh yeah. Another thing showed up. <laughs> Die! <laughs> oh wait. Mom? Huh? Futaba. Thank you for choosing to remember the real me. Ah. Oh. I'm sorry for being so selfish. Mom. Don't come over here. This isn't where you're supposed to be, is it? But I finally got to see you again. Are you being selfish again? Nah. Um, I... I love you, Mom. I love you too, Futaba. Oh, that's so sweet. Now, you should get going. Right, Majid. Yeah. Where are you going? Home. I know how to use the nav now. That was fast, okay. Huh. Oh, right. Okay, well, bye. You're on a team now, right? She left. That girl marches to the beat of her own drum, doesn't she? Yeah. Like you're one to talk. You got a little bit of sass in it. I like it. We have her on our side. Wait, what about her treasure? I wonder if she'll be able to scan enemies then, like Fuka and Risa could. And just tell me what their you know, weaknesses and strengths are are right out. Oh, that'd be awesome. Oh, yeah, we almost forgot. Oh, so that's empty? <laughs> What's going on? Wasn't it supposed to be here? Was the. Oh, was that, was that the treasure of the mom there we just saw? Futaba herself was the treasure. Oh. And she's gone, so of course it's empty. Shoot. This is bad. How the fuck does that make any sense, Morgana? What's the matter? Not only did the real person come into her own palace, she awakened to a persona while she was here. This place could collapse any second now. Oh, God. We've accomplished our mission if her palace is crumbling. We should hurry back to reality. That would be wise. Run! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> oh my god! Go 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 go! It's catching up to us. Running here's a bitch. Turn into a car already. I know, I know. Go, Morgana! Morgana, move me up! Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, right. Morgana's booty. Ah. Uh, whoa. Ow. Uh, Where is this life is the photograph? That was awesome. Who was driving? I didn't even see it. Was hey. You guys still alive? Uh... <laughs> ah, my butt hurts again. I thought I was gonna die and... Uh, hey! Will you let go already? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> Poor Yusuke, he's always getting punched in the face by Aunt. Not again. What was that sound? Oh, hi daddy, we're just uh, roughhousing, you know. What are you guys doing out here? Oh, um... We're starting our own little league baseball team. Reminds me, where's Futaba? What about Futaba? Oh, um... Yes, we came all this way, so how about we enjoy some coffee? Oh, that's a great idea! Why are you all bleeding? Oh... You know, no, I, I don't know. I'm used to him bleeding all the time, but you guys bleed too. That's fine, but I'm not thirsty though. <laughs> oh, I almost got <laughs> it. Ah, oh, right in my manhood. I have some business to take care of, so you guys go on ahead. 
No, oh, I'm so sick of this shit. Oh, rat. Futaba? Oh, she out here. Seriously, you put some Can shoes you hear on. Me? Please say something. Please. Could this be our fault? Is it because we defeated her monstrous mother? No. That was nothing more than a cognitive being created in her mind. Destroying it wouldn't cause memory loss or put a physical burden on her. What should we do? Hey, don't you know a doctor? You do. Can you contact them? They're literally right down there. Let's just go. A house call is going to cost you, you know. It's fine. I got money. How much will it be? That was a joke. <laughs> so, um, how is her condition? Her pulse, breathing, temperature, and blood pressure are all normal. No ocular abnormalities either. I'm not sure why, but it seems this girl is in some kind of light stupor. Furthermore, she lacks muscle for her age. I doubt she has much stamina either. Yeah, because she's been cooped up in a room. I see. The rebound from her awakening was too strong. There may have been too many abnormal circumstances. We simply cannot keep quiet about this. We should let Boss know. Wouldn't he figure out our identities? Still, we should tell him, shouldn't we? Let's go get him. Let's keep quiet. Let's wait for now. No. Nah, I gotta go get him. Mm. I think that would be best. Hopefully Dad is okay with that. Letting him know is really the only option we have. I guess it can't be helped now. Just keep the circumstances that led up to this a secret, okay? Hey, Futaba? Hey! Huh? <sighs> oh dear. Uh, um, about Futaba. Well, why do you guys look so down? Futaba-chan's condition. Oh, is this something that's happened to her before? What, this? It happens every so often. Huh? She must have used up all her energy. It's like she ran out of batteries. I think it happens because she doesn't get enough exercise. Nah. What? She stays like this for a few days whenever this happens. I'll make sure she gets plenty of rest. Here, keep an eye on her. I'm gonna go close the store. <laughs> All right, bye. I don't care. It's hard to describe how I feel right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm feeling pretty frustrated. <laughs> oh, hey guys, look, she's got a, a movie poster for the Featherman on the movie. Oh my God, how did I not know that existed? I wonder if it was as amazing as the Power Rangers movie. God, that movie was truly, okay, it was kind of shit actually. I'm glad she's okay, but what are we gonna do about Medjed? Uh, ah! She's up! She lives! Mm, Medjed. Uh, uh, tired. Gonna sleep for a bit. <gasps> she fell asleep again?! <laughs> she fell asleep again?! Futaba-chan! For a bit? How much is she planning on sleeping? We probably shouldn't wake her up either. What to do? It's too late for us to find another hacker. All we can do is wait for her to wake up. <laughs> That's gonna be a whole month. <laughs> Till all the way to the deadline. Is with her. I'm sure everything will be okay. I just gotta wait for Futaba to wake up. She in my party here? Oh, I don't see her, no. But I did see her level up at some point. You better join my party. That little gooba head. <sighs> oh, you're making record of your daily activities? I have to say, this world is cruel for treating you like a criminal. <laughs> Thanks, Morgana. Oh, that was, damn, that was a good one. Oh, that's uh, awesome. I'm sure she'll join our team then. And I guess, and I'm betting actors are, are like our scanner uh, 
our, our scanner person. So awesome! Yes. Well, uh, I can't wait to to get to know her more. But goddamn, this game is fucking cocaine! I swear. I played for a long time tonight, so uh, I don't think I'm even gonna have enough time to uh, edit for tomorrow, so I'll probably have to take tomorrow off. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed these episodes. I'm sure multiple episodes. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. It really does help me out. And subscribe if you're not already. Become a picky penguin. Or the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy. Hey, Bernie. Sunbathing? Yes, I'm sunbathing. <laughs> My little leggies out. So every day I usually come out here and just kind of sit outside with her. She, she loves loves being outside. Yeah. You know where I miss Bernie. Yes, I do. Gotta get my tan on. How do you think I, how do you think I stay this dark all the time? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, goodness. Oh, it is toasty though, so I always gotta make sure I bring out some, some ice water. Yeah, she got her little bone that she could choose on, and she just has a good old time, isn't that right? Yes. And she hit. Little snorty thing. Hey, this is a very private moment. Stop recording me. <laughs> I am not your tool to do as you as you please. Sorry, Bernie, but the but the penguins just love you too much. God dang it! It's not easy being a pop idol. Ha, ha, ha.